In our last video, we learned about hue and the colour spectrum. Now let's take a closer look at how we can manipulate colour through tonal adjustment and see what that does to the mood and energy of a space. Every colour has a tonal value. Imagine photocopying a colour in black and white. That gives you an indication of the depth or value of that colour. You can change the tone of a colour by adding white to tint it and make it lighter, or adding black to shade it and make it darker. This first example is a room where the tonal value of the colours is all very light and there is little contrast. The result of using all light colours in a space means that it feels airy and open. It can feel feminine. It's good to note though that too much white can make a space feel stark. The introduction of other design elements like texture can help soften the look. Spaces where the main colour is tonally very light but there are accents of dark colours brings a very different look to the space. The major contrast in the highlights of dark accents bring energy and drama to the space. Then, let's take a look at rooms where the tonal value of the majority of the colour in the room is mid-tone. There isn't too much contrast between any of the tonal value, and generally this combination feels very relaxed and calm. When the majority of the space is medium in tone, but there are accents of contrasting dark tones, the feel is still relaxed, but slightly more formal. Finally, let's take a look at rooms where the colours are mainly dark in tone, with very little contrast. The feeling is quite cosy and enveloping. Rooms that have a dark colour as the main colour, but have the addition of contrasting light accents, can feel quite smart, formal and almost masculine. So it's easy to see that by manipulating the tone of value of colour, along with the proportion you use, you're able to create schemes that vary from light and airy to cosy and comfy to deep and dramatic. 